Bonjour mes amis. Welcome to my channel, The French Station, the right stop for learning French. My name is Vignesh, your teacher and friend. I'm very thrilled to help you on your French learning journey and to make the language fun and easy for you. In this video, we will move ahead with the exercises from lesson 8. The first exercise, complete avec, complete with. There are a few options given over here. We need to complete the blanks using these options. Let's go through the options first. Petit fils, which is nothing but grandson. Mère, mother. Fille, daughter. Grand-père, grandfather. Sir, sister. Fils, son. The first sentence. Monsieur Charles Lavigne et le dash de Manuel. Mr. Charles Lavigne is dash of manual. If we go through the unseen passage given in this lesson, we know that Charles Lavigne is the grandfather. The grandmother's name is Francoise Lavigne. The mother's name is Patrick Lavigne. And the father's name is Veronique Lavigne. And Manuel's brother's name is Dennis. He has a sister too. Her name is Catherine. So the first answer is grandpère. Charles Lavigne is the grandfather of Manuel. The second one, Catherine A. Ladash, the Denis Emmanuel. Catherine is dash for Dennis and Manuel. She's the sister. She's their sister. So the second answer is sir. The third one, Denis A. Ladash, the Monsieur Charles Lavigne A. Madame Francoise Lavigne. So Dennis is the dash for Mr. Charles Lavigne and Madame Francoise Lavigne. He's the petit fils. He's the grandson. He's the grandson. The fourth one, Madame Veronique Lavigne et la dash de Denise, Manuel et Catherine. So Madame Veronique Lavigne is the dash of Dennis. Manuel and Catherine, she's their mother. So the answer is Mère. The fifth one, Catherine et la dash, the Monsieur Patrick Lavigne et Madame Veronique Lavigne. Catherine is the dash of Mr. Patrick and Madame Veronique. She's their daughter. So the answer is P. The sixth one, Manuel et la dash, the Veronique. Manuel is dash of Veronique. And the answer is fees. He is her son. So the answer is fees. Let's move ahead with the second exercise. Conjugue se verb. Parle, abite, eme, deteste. So here they are asking us to conjugate the verbs. All these are regular ER verbs. Parle is to talk. Abite, to live. Eme, to like. Deteste, to hate. We've already learned that for the ER verbs, we are supposed to remove ER and then add E, ES, E, ONS, EZ, and END. By following that rule, we can conjugate all these verbs. One thing that we need to remember is EME and ABITE. ABITE is a verb that begins in mute H, and EME is a verb that begins in a vowel. So when you're conjugating them in the je form, we're supposed to write j apostrophe. We write jabit, which is I live, and we write jem, which is I like. But for the other two verbs, we write je. For example, we say je parle. I talk or I'm talking. This way, you need to conjugate all the four verbs in the other forms as well, the theo form, il, el, the nu, vu, and ils, elles forms. Let's move ahead with the third exercise. Complete avec le verb à la forme convenable. Complete using the verbs in the correct form. So here they've given the infinitive forms within the brackets. We need to look at the subject pronouns or the subject and then write down the correct conjugation. The first one, il, parle is given within the brackets. So the answer is parle. Il parle français. He speaks 
friends. P A R L E is the right answer. The second one, Nu Zabito or Delhi. So we need to remove E R from Abite and write O N S. Nu Zabito or Delhi. We live in Delhi. Manuel M La Glass. Manuel likes ice creams. Manuel is masculine singular. So in English we say instead of saying Manuel we can use the word he. Same thing in French also instead of saying Manuel you can use the word il. So the conjugation has to be in the il form. The fourth one, Uzabite or Doha. Do you live in Doha? So we just have to remove er from abite and write ez instead. The fifth one, j'aime la télévision. I like the television. The sixth one, ils aiment la musique classique. They like classical music. So we write a i m e e n t because we have i l s over here. The seventh one. Tu parles espagnol? Do you speak Spanish? Parle is supposed to be written with an es. The eighth one. Mon père s'appelle Monsieur Lavigne. My father's name is Mr. Lavigne. Ninth one. J'habite dans cette maison. I live in this house. Dans is in. Set maison. Set means this or that. So I live in this house or that house. The tenth one, L par l'Italien. They speak Italian. Here L is a group of girls. So the conjugation should be P A R L E N T. Thank you so much for watching the video. Please subscribe to my channel, The French Station, to get notified on the upcoming videos. Like it and share it with your friends as well. Until then, a bientôt. See you soon.